Lum de dum de dum. Working in a hospital, getting minimum wage. Oh, that is the essence of a part time worker such as I, you, Narukami, in the hospital place. I wish me in real life, Zoinados, had a part time job, but instead I'm making YouTube videos. But it's not because of the YouTube videos, it's because no one is accepting people. For shame. Welcome back, everyone, to the hard times, these hard, relenting times. Like the video, subscribe to the video. It means a lot to little old me. Yeah, that's right. I'm guilt tripping. I'm hella guilt tripping. You better like and subscribe. Yeah, that's right. Now it's threatening. <laughs> you busily cleaned recently the vacated hospital room. Dum de dum de dum. Look at me. I'm so happy. Oh no, what's that? I'm so. Oh no, what's that? I'm so spooked. You decide to pretend. Yeah. Easy. Courage is increased beyond its maximal potential. And then she's like, um. <laughs> <laughs> what do you want to do today? I want a GTFO from you, bruh. <laughs> what do you want to do today? I want to get the fuck out of here, boy. You earned 80 bucks. You earned 80 bucks. 80 bucks. If, if you're like working a 9 to 5 job, like 9. 10, 11, 12, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That's 8 hours, right? 8 hours. You'd usually, like, want $11 an hour or something like that, right? And then it'd be... But this is, like, 80 bucks. Actually, yeah. No, I was thinking $8, like, $1 an hour. And I was like, yo, that's slave labor. What's this hospital paying? Or these... Uh, ding dong, bing bong. Ugh. I need laws against these controller, boy. Classes have ended, and there's no one to talk to, except maybe the fox, huh? Maybe he'll help me. Going to town, baby? Actually, no. You know what? Scratch that. I need to see if there's anyone in the... Giving me free stuff from a home, eck. <laughs> wow. My school had a home, eck, class when I, like, first went there. But once... I hit ninth grade, right, 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 because I'll preface this again. If I hadn't said it before, I started eighth grade in high school. I know it's crazy. Like, why would they even do that? But it helped me in the end. It helped me. I had some great role models, and I had some more great model role models throughout the years, especially you, Narukami. I played this in tenth grade. Oh, the memories. Oh, but yeah, eighth grade. I had home ec. I really wanted to do it, but I couldn't because I was an 8th grader. <laughs> Stupid me. And then <laughs> and then I hit ninth grade and I was like, Well, sorry to say, but that's not a class anymore you can take. Huh? Although although the, the good thing, at least, at least, I had some sort of like home ec experience. Because I was a part of the... I was a part of student government. I know, like... <laughs> I don't want to bash and you know what I'll just keep my mouth mouth, mouth shut about that actual happening but I was happy that I was able to cook and allow myself to be in the experience of making food for others to enjoy oh I love that I also love making those fancy egg omelets those rice omelets omelet to rice as the Japanese like to say, because there's no of in the language, it's just omelette rice, not the rice of omelette. Bruh. <laughs> what should we buy? Actually, we're pretty good on most of these stuff. Go home. And, you know what? Sure, why not? We could buy those. And Vanish Falls actually are going to become useless, because one more level up, and then Risa is just going to learn... The inevitable escape thing or something. I'll need two of these because they saved actually my butt. They saved my butt so many times. And I think that's about to it. You know what? That was a wonderful rainy day special. Please come again. Please come again. My controller always keeps breaking. Ding dong, bling blong. Oh, look at me. How relatable. Although, actually... Ooh, ooh, even if the Xbox control, I mean, uh, whatever. The Xbox controller disconnects, right? Did I say this before? I don't know. 
You know what? Eh, I'll say it again. The Xbox controller, no matter how many times I make fun of it disconnecting, it is actually one of... It's probably... No, it is the most durable controller that I have ever just had. The, the analog stick, joystick, whatever you want to call it, those still work. I have a PlayStation 4 controller for the PlayStation 4, in which I'm like, you know, also hoping to record the trails of cold steel finish up that recording session because i have games on the playstation 4 but either way playstation 4 controller is cracked it's not it's not like actually cracked but it's like you know crack crack I'm like, ha, ha. actually so stupid i can't control sometimes i have to like blow create hot air into the the right little bumper button and then I, sometimes i have to like hit the joystick because the, control, the character moves on his own. So they have to like vap it in the opposite direction. I remember playing a game and then the controller was just standing there and the character was just walking. And I was like, yeah, I was like, and I wasn't even holding the controller. It was like, kind of like that in a way. And then I was like, oh, he's moving on his own. Is it a ghost? No, it's just my controller being honk and donk. And I... And also, I'm not I'm not going to just include PlayStation 4. I'm also going to compare the Joy-Cons. I haven't experienced that, but there have been reports of Joy-Con drift. Hey. Cool. Nintendo Boy is going to cry me or ever still, but guess what? I certainly believe the Xbox controller actually is the most durable. Yep. Considering the fact that it's not just the Joy Cons, but also the the PlayStation 4 controller just don't work. They're probably, I think the PlayStation 4 controller is like cheaply made or something. I want a car back. All right, box. I'll accept the request. That's all I can do. I don't think I can actually do it on this rainy day. Wow. Actually, I don't even think I can actually do that on the rainy day. You know what? Talking about life, we wish our dog would return. Our family wishes that their dog, Koro, would return home. Now, let me look in my lovely notepad that I keep handing. Now, we see the, 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 the dog boy, right? Obtain the dog. <laughs> Obtain the dog. Ah, oh, yes. Okay. Where to now? Well, it's raining, so I'd presume nowhere. Ah, if we leave the shopping district. I guess the only other place would be the floodplain. Hey, look at that. Hey, how predictable. Samagawa floodplain. I love the leaves, though. But I wish it was snowing. Like I said previously, I know that Persona 4 Golden has snow season. That's good in a way. And, uh, in contrast to what I'm experiencing outside, it was, like, actually barren. It was raining yesterday, but for some reason, it's, like, an actual snowstorm just blizzard on by. And now, like, everywhere is full of snow. And it's just crazy. I was planning on taking a walk because yesterday wasn't really anything. And now, I'll just be a little cold. I have nowhere to sit my bum out in the outside world, you know? Like, I would sit my bum on those stairs over there. But, like, if there's snow, I don't want to sit my bum on those stairs. Because then my my butt will get, like, you know, wet. Full of uh, snow. It's raining. There might be a... There may be a mighty fish here today. Yeah, I love fishing. I love this content. Whoa, look at me. Time to fish. Yet again. What other things can I talk about? Besides... Bland commentary on fishing. Huh. New day, new me. Am I right? Ba 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 boys. It's been like how long in the episode? I don't know. Oh oh oh! I pressed the button just on time. I was about to like quit that for a second. Uh, my thumb hurts. Oh oh! Thank goodness the quick time event. Ow ow ow! Great. All right. I'd rather toss you out with the others. My diligence. Oh. I mean, is it really optimal? 
Oh. I need the mighty fish. I need the mighty fish for an item that the old man sells, but not now. But he probably does in December. And I was like, ugh. Why can't I just get it? I need... I press that square. I press that square. Uh, cringe. Cringe. Game's cringe. Because I got a trout. That's why. And I don't want to tout. Because I got a trout, baby. And I know I ain't saying it, baby. And I don't want to be a little crazy. But I know it's true. Nope. Those intervals were a little bit too fast. A little bit too impeculiar for my own liking. I'm just praying. I can't concentrate when I'm trying to make a story or trying to do this. If I had this as background gameplay and I was just spewing my just words. What? 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 Oh, okay. For a second. I thought it's one of those times that just made you just rage quit. That feeling went rage. That feeling went the embodiment of wrath. That feeling went meme. Oh, this might be it? This might be it. This might be it. I, 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 what? The fish wriggled out of your hook. I was spamming that button once it got down. Bro. Nah. Ugh. Pish posh. I already wasted a bait. Oh, no. Does my diligence decrease from that? I don't really do lots of fishing besides at the end of the month. For this game in particular. You know, the old version. I've had the old version since, like, 10th grade. Like I mentioned previously on today's wonderful episode. Oh, Persona 4, how you've changed my life. Changed the essence and fiber of my own being. Aw, for shame, though, that the one thing that Persona 4, like, touts and preaches... Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, come on, I pressed the button. The fish wriggled on the water. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, whatever. The one thing Persona 4 touts and proclaims in theme... Oh, nah, this isn't the one. See how fast this is going. I keep getting distracted because I'm pressing button consistently. Singular button. The one thing Persona tells consistently is like friendship and like social links. And it's like happy, happy, fun time. You know, in high school, it's like, oh, you're talking to all your friends. I'm tired. Of course it wasted my diligence. <laughs> of course it wasted it. Who? Oh, I'm just. <laughs> right, leap, go so go. Ugh. No, I don't want to press that button. But the thing about, like, you know, touting friendship and happiness and happy, happy, fun times, right? With Persona 4 is uh, being able to have those interactions with with uh, people. And because you're having those interactions, it's helping you because we are social beings and we are social creatures. And we need to hang out with people in order to like be happy because if you're alone because like in when we were like caveman style like if you're alone you probably die so it was better to be in communities right but like besides oh you thought the, you heard the woman scream oh my courage increased you decided to pretend not to notice and continued cleaning yo that's based jk 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 not based not based She's just angry. Oh, you're here. Oh, hello. You have voice acting for that one line. It's like it looks like she's in a bad mood. Are you based today? I don't know. Maybe. Did you hear that commotion? I didn't really want to interrupt you, you know? That was the first time anyone ever called me a slutty bitch to my face. Wow, it's like a soap opera. So cool. Seriously. Uh. When he laughed at her feeble attempt at an insult, she scratched at me. <laughs> Use the bitch now. <laughs> uh, controller broke. Bing dong, bing bong. Who would have known? <laughs> she called me a slut. <laughs> Isn't that like <laughs> she? She can't even get at me, bro. Just because I like you know flirt with like 
A lot of boys. Doesn't mean I'm like a slut or anything like that. <laughs> Previous hospital, I had a relationship with one of my dogs. Oh. But he had... Really? I mean... You're both bad. You're both bad. She found out. I was forced to quit. I was... Oh, so you just quit? There wasn't like, you know, any divorces that... Ugh. He started working here not too long. It seems he began flirting and... Ah. Uh. So what I'm getting is, you didn't know about the relationship. And... He has a dong that cannot be quenched by a single woman. Or maybe that single woman is just not really uh, fulfilling his desires. And then he's like, I'm super horny. Or like, you know, this marriage is like cringe or something. Either way, eh. He's cringe, brother. I don't know what happened, but I got dragged back into it. His wife came all the way here to bitch at me. Bruh, 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 bruh. I'm not even like, you know, like interacting with him anymore. That's why I, <laughs> I quit. The other nurses were just watching with the stupid smirks. I'm like, <laughs> I'd wish I seen it. Hey, how can you talk like that? This isn't your problem. Hmm. Oh wait, I guess it isn't. <laughs> what was I thinking? That's what you get for talking to a hubby <sighs> who just has a, a dong that just evil, like a devil or kind of freak. What am I working for? What am I even doing? What am I even living for? What rank am I? Like. Five? <laughs> Do I want to be in a relationship with her? Hmm? <laughs> Comfort her. I'm oh, I'm sorry. sorry. I was just grumbling to myself. Thank you. Aww. You're a kind boy. You feel that you understand Sayoko more. I think it's more the hubby's fault now that I'm getting the bigger picture. It's like, oh. I cheated on my wife with you, and then she was like, Yo, I just thought because I was like a flirty person, and the wife came. Why, why is she even married? She said the wife came into the hospital still. Bro. And the guy's still cheating? It's an unstable relationship. Although. Ugh. Cringe. I better get going. I'm sure that bitch Goodbye, gone now. by now. Be careful going home. <laughs> You finished your job and went home. You earned like 80 bucks. That's pretty swag, ain't it? That's like minimum wage. <laughs> Yo, it's raining again. It's the same thing. Same day. Early morning after school. B -b -b baby, let's go. Ugh, why? Ugh, I'm so still angry at that little hospital scene. Not at her. Because I'm giving her the benefit of doubt of not knowing. I'm angry at the fact that that hubby and that the wife have an unstable relationship. The hubby's like, yeah, I'm gonna like cheating on several women. And then the and then the girl's like, I still love you. Ugh. If you were if you were if she just threatened the act of <laughs> if she just threatened divorce with the cheater, then the hubby would be like, No, 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 no. And then she'd be like, Yeah, who's under my foot now, bitch? <laughs> This is the men's bathroom. Enter. Ugh. You know what sucks about love, though? I mean... Oh, I'm gonna make paper cranes. Oh, yeah, I gotta do that for, like, charity work or something. Eh, whatever. But going back to that whole spiel with the devil arc, kind of, I mean, like... Ugh. That woman needs to put her foot down. She can't... She's also acting as a bad... She's, she's like, slightly in the wrong, but not as wrong as, like, you know, the hubby. Because the hubby, like, cheated on her. It's like, hey... But the woman's like enabling. Am I acting too PC right now? Cringe. <laughs> but I think it's true to just realize that love is weird. And ooh, ooh, here's a good life lesson. Here is a wonderful life lesson. Write down your notes. Here's some Zuinato's love advice 101. You know, I might not really have, you know, really any relationships. I can really back my claims up. But, because I watch other people, and I play Persona 4, I'm technically like a god in relationships. Like, <laughs> just saying. But here's the relationship advice. That you should have your, you have your notepad? Up, oh, up. Oh, you don't? Okay, I'll give you time. Oh, remember. If you have a computer, you could just type. Yeah. Okay, you got it? Alright, Google Docs? Sure. Alright. You got your little notes? Alright, got it. Here's some love advice. You're like, wondering to yourself, 
what let's just say you're in high school for example you're like wah, wah, wah. why don't they love me why doesn't he love me i want to be loved one way to uh get his love or don't get his love i mean first what am i even doing what am i even doing what am i even doing anymore i don't want to fish i don't want to fish i want to walk if you if you want to get his love first off don't be desperate see that woman she's in the persona 4 she's most likely desperate because she's probably like afraid or something that she's gonna be left alone oh uh, hell yeah she is being left alone by who uh her hubby that's who because he's been cheating uh just sad sometimes you know divorces it's just uh eh. but don't be desperate yeah don't be desperate that's uh, that's that's one thing that's that's one thing you should write down in your little podcast notes. Another thing too, you're always complaining about, ah, oh, you don't love me, blah, 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 blah. Uh, I guess work on yourself first, you know? Work on having a personality, you know? Stop actually going with the popular trend. It's okay to like, like it, but to actively just base your personality off of the popular trend. OMG. I wear Yeezys and I have the iPhone insert newest to number here. Yeah. And my Yeezys are white, but I'm not actually going to wear them out in public. Oh, they get dirty. Bro, they're, they're sneakers. They're on your feet. The feet are on the ground. Bro, what do you even mean? What do you even mean you're not supposed to wear them? Oh. No. Oh. Konishi, like Yo Yosuke for example. Oh, Yosuke had a little crush on the the girl Sayuka or whatever, who got just slam dunked onto a. <laughs> what am I even saying? She got slam dunked. Oh, yo, I didn't win any prizes. Eh, that's okay. Yeah, Yosuke was, I think, a little too desperate, you know. He was trying everything for her. And then she was like, uh, no, I got you under my heels. <laughs> shame though, a shame. Don't be desperate. Develop a personality. Okay, those are two points. What else? Because I don't want to like, you know, there's more than like two points. For Solinado's love advice 101, baby. Hmm. I mean, love it. Oh, here's the other one. You're, you're thinking to yourself, yo, how come this person is dating this person? How? Oh, and here's a good analogy, right? Because, you know, Persona 4, it's fiction, so it's not like, you know, that harsh. You know that, that woman who's like, ah, oh, I'm still in a relationship with uh, my hubby who's an actual cheater. You know how, like, some people, ugh, cringe though, but some people are getting, like, slapped and hit and abused. Oh, poor things. But they're still, like, in the relationship. It's an abusive relationship. I know, I know. Poor thing. But people, why are they still in? Can't they just, like, you know, not be in it anymore? Well, the thing with is about love is love is an emotional thing, not a logical thing. No matter how much you think logically about the whole situation, and I'm not... Oh, ooh, it's not, is that a challenge? <laughs> Revenge of the Riddles Empire. All right, is it time for another logical throwdown? Once again, the categories. All right, F's in group, oh, hold on with the love stuff for a second. <laughs> F's in group A, G's in group B, N is in group A, O's in group B. Uh, 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 N is group B, okay. Oh, yeah? They're, they're consonants. Whoa, you blew, okay, okay. What? Oh, no. <laughs> whatever, whatever. Okay, yeah, back to the abusive relationships. <laughs> oh, that's not something I <laughs> want to be <laughs> clipped out of context. Okay. You know, you're like wondering. Yeah, because love is an emotional thing, and the brain is a logical thing. You're looking at the situation at a logical perspective, and then you're like, yo, just don't be in a relationship. However, love is crazy, and those hormones be a badonka donk crazy. And then you realize that no matter how much you want to, like, look at the situation logically, if someone loves you, 
they will do anything for you. And that is powerful, and that sometimes goes into, like, manipulation and, like, uh, stuff and blah, blah, blah. But that also, like, uh, can apply to other things. Not, like, you know, the drastic uh, comparison of an abusive relationship. Well, let's just say, for example, just a person who you seem or deem to be relatively ugly or unattractive. And then there's this butte 10 out of 10 babe. And really, it's just all about perspective, really. I mean, like, 7 out of 10 for me, but like, yeah, whatever, whatever. <laughs> You're like, how can this dude, who's like that and like ugly, and then look at this hourglass figure, babe, hunka hunka mother. Well, the thing is that she loves this dude, and it doesn't matter, like, how much he looks, right? She loves him, and that's all that really matters. That's all that really matters in the end. That's actually all that really matters. It's just all about luck, baby. It's all about that luck stat, baby. You Narukami, what's his luck stat? <laughs> all right, let's look at his luck stat, for example. All right, all right, let's get it. It's at 28. Oh, is that is that supposed to forewarn something about the multiple relationships he has? But you know what? Even if it's at 28, it's still a percentage of 100%, right? Even if you are unlucky, you are sometimes lucky. And... I guess that's what it means to be lucky, right? To, you know, be lucky. <laughs> but yeah, someone... Love, this is the third point. Someone will love you no matter what. No matter what you do. No matter even if you go to the gym. No matter how many times you work out. No matter how many times you, like, use... Pick up lines on ladies. No matter how many times you, like, talk to women. Be, be outgoing. Being courageous. Uh, I sound like an incel. <laughs> But hey, oh, my controller's broken. Oh, I was talking about this earlier. <laughs> oh my, oh. You know, Kami's like, I want to get out of this. I don't want to be an incel anymore. I'm Chad, you know, Kami. I don't know why I want He's running away from his earth. What the heck? Oh yeah, see, look at that. The controller, of course it breaks. What the heck? Oh, wait. I feel like the controller just actually just died. I'm disconnecting it properly, and I'm reconnecting it. Like, I need to reconnect myself to the video game. Alright, there we go. One, two, three. Hello, lady. How's it going? I got in a fight with Senpai. He had a sad expression. He asked me, How could you say something like that? I couldn't go back anymore. I had to know what he was doing to someone else. Ah, she's stalking him from the shadows. Oh, yeah, also. Here's the fourth tip of advice. I think I said something about, uh... Um... I don't know what I said previously. <laughs> uh, bad recollection. I mean, I'm also playing a video game at the exact same time. Like, what do you want me to do? Hey, what do you want me to do? Uh, what, what were the points? Like, so, uh, whatever. The main point is someone will love you no matter what. You know? It, it, that's crazy. I think. Also, I think another thing is if you don't actually tell the person how you feel... I mean, it's kind of obvious, but don't be a pussy and just tell them if you really love them. Wow. How true is that? But that's like the hardest one out of all of them, considering the fact that you're going to be a little scared shrimp, such as I. But eventually, you're going to realize that, you know what? You got to suck up. You got to deal with the consequences, baby. You got to deal with them. You got to deal with them. You got to deal with your actions. And sometimes life just gives you a dice roll and you just gotta live with it. You got those cards and then you're like, oh boy. Well, that kind of sucked. Damn, this episode was all about like love life uh, affairs and the whole lady. Oh, it was a good episode. A good episode about teaching little kids and little high school whole high schoolians just about love and life. And you gotta learn. Love, l live, and learn. Make sure, well, either way, if you if you like someone, I think I think reason comes to shove that they won't, it doesn't matter even how much you go to the gym, how much you have those protein shakes, of five secret methods to get the lady. <laughs> five, 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 ten ways to get the girl. Number eight. Number one. Actually, like, you know, talk to her. <laughs> Because it would be a stalker. Of course it's going to be creepy, but eh, whatever. Eh, whatever. I'm done with it. 
People are gonna love you no matter what. Boy or girl. You know what I'm saying? Doesn't matter. Uh, and, and times and emotions are very, uh, in the now or something. They, they change. Logic is very firm, you know? Very firm, very rigid. Like 2 plus 2, you know? It's always gonna equal 4. But emotions be like, nah, sometimes it equals 5. <laughs> and then you're like, huh? And then you're like, yeah, it does equal 5. <laughs> That's what emotions are like. <laughs> But then sometimes, like, oh, whatever, whatever. Blah, blah, blah. Sometimes I get too caught up in these things. Yeah, look at you, Narakami. He's like, ugh, just end the episode already. We already know you're in this room. And I'm like, yeah, sure. I'll preface this again. If you're feeling sad and lonely about people who are going to be, oh, well, they don't love me. Well, guess what? They will love you, maybe, if you confess their feelings. Right? Because emotions can change. Right, right, right. And you, you gotta, like, you know, build that spirit. I know. It's high school. I know. Like, all that social hierarchy. But, like, at Persona 4, like, hey. In the end of the day, it doesn't matter about, you know, all that stuff. I mean, we're, we're gonna die in the end. <laughs> we're, we're all gonna die. I mean, like, hey. Hey, better to just, like, you know, do everything you can before, you know, you cease to exist. But also, confessing your love to someone, maybe then it's like, like, one of those anime tropes, like, oh, I'm a, like, tsundere, blah, 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 or I'm just like, I'm just a classic girl, and I'm just like, oh, and then you're like, I love you, and then they're like, oh, I don't love you, but then they have, like, those, then she's like, le blush, looking in the mirror, talking to herself in, like, an anime monologue for two minutes, like, oh, does he really, he loves me, I don't, I don't, I don't know how to handle him anymore, and then, like, for the next, like, couple days or like weeks and then she like averts her eyes and like oh and then you're like oh i'm sad she doesn't like me and then she's like oh i kind of like him now people be crazy and you know what i think now is a good time to end off this episode i don't really have anything to say people love you no matter what and make sure to actually tell them your feelings Cause you will never know cause that's just the game of life my name is zoinados like and subscribe and happy happy fun times yeah woo i that's been so long in this episode well i hope you all enjoyed though it's a very long episode about life you know oh it's my favorite love you to bits and peace